Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel and right now pag-usapan po natin is the latest update sa Google AdSense which is facing out Western Union as payment option. So if you have questions about it at gusto mo siyang malaman, please do stay tuned! Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. This is Teen Talks. For today, pag-usapan natin ang latest update about Google AdSense which is concerning Western Union being phased out as a payment option. So, ano nga ba yung ipig sabihin dong latest announcement ng Google AdSense about Western Union? It says that as of August 10, 2020, you will no longer be able to select Western Union as a new form of payment. We recommend that publishers currently using Western Union switch to another available payment method before payments through Western Union stop in early 2021. We will inform current users in advance as to when Western Union can no longer be used to receive payments in their country. It's simply saying that moving forward, for those na hindi pa nakakapag-select, again, hindi pa nakakapag-select ng kanilang uh, payment options, hindi nyo na po makikita ang Western Union doon as part of the choices and you will be left out with just two options which is bank transfer and through check. But unfortunately, for the Philippines, ang pinaka-applicable sa atin ay bank transfer. Kasi hindi ka pwedeng pumili ng through check hanggat pwede kang magkaroon ng bank account. And sa Philippines, madali naman kumuha ng bank account. So most likely, ang may iwan na lang na options sa ating lahat moving forward ay through bank transfers. So ano yung mga magiging difference? For me, na nakakasweldo na sa Western Union, um, by uh, early 2021, doon pa lang magsisimula na mag-face out sa amin yun. And doon pa lang kami magsisimulang mag-transition sa bank transfers. Pero yung mga hindi pa nakakasweldo at hindi pa nakakapili ng option. For example, hindi mo pa natatanggap ang PIN mo, pero sinetap mo na yung payment options mo at pinili mo na sa si Western Union. Pag dumating ang PIN mo ngayon, makakasweldo ka pa rin through Western Union until 2021, early 2021. Pero kung hindi mo pa natatanggap yung PIN mo at hindi mo pa rin na set up yung payment options mo, pag ngayon mo ginawa yun, wala na doon si Western Union. So, ano ba yung magiging effect sa atin pag natanggal si Western Union? Um, one, syempre, kung wala ka pang bank account, you have to open a bank account. And alam natin, pag may bank account tayo, merong minimum uh, maintaining balance. So, medyo um, Doon sa mga sakto pa lang ang kinikita kay YouTube at kung first time nyo pa lang mag-open ng bank account, then hindi mo makukuha yung buong pera mo because you have to put a maintaining balance. And currently, it's um, 2,000 or 5,000 as a maintaining balance for uh, commercial banks. So, you just have to choose your banks kung ano yung malapit sa'yo, convenient sa'yo, at pagkakatiwalaan mo. So, those are the things that you have to consider in choosing your bank. And of course, kapag bank transfers na ang pinili natin as payment options, there would be a corresponding transaction fee. And uh, for example, if I'm be using my bank, it's BDO. For BDO, natanong ko na sila and it's $10 ang kanilang transaction fee. I also ask about BPI and for BPI, it's $14 as their transaction fee. What does it mean? Pag sumeldo ka na, pinadala na ni Google AdSense sa banko mo yung sweldo mo, automatic may kaltas ka na transaction fee doon sa yung matatanggap na pera. So, compared to Western Union, walang kaltas na ganun. Pero dito, pagdating kay uh, bank transfers, meron na. That's one of the major difference with Western Union and the bank transfer. Um, medyo malaki kasi if it's $10, it's around 490 to 500 pesos agad yung kalta sa atin. So, ano yung positive effect naman ng bank transfer? Of course, it's about safety and security of the money. You don't have to go physically to Western Union anymore to withdraw the money. Lalo na kung big amounts yung i-withdraw mo kasi direct na siyang ipapadala ni Google AdSense sa banko mo. Those are the things na positive effect naman ng bank transfers. And uh, the difference also, syempre, don't expect yung mga exchange rate because it differs. Mas mababa naman talaga kasi exchange rate pagdating sa banko. So, those are the difference that I see when doing bank transfers and Western Union. So, 
Um, kung hindi pa kayo nakaka-choose ng payment options at wala pa rin kayong bank account, then it's high time to start researching and looking at your area anong banko yung pwede yung gamitin for those bank transfers. Kasi yun na lang talaga yung magiging option natin dito sa Philippines until they make another option. So, kung existing Western Union ka naman na sumasweldo, monetized channel ka na like me, nakasweldo na ako through Western Union, the transition would be starting early 2021. So, makakasweldo pa tayo through Western Union, yung mga bagong monetize na lang, ang hindi na. Kasi unti-unti na nila tayong ita-transition sa bank transfer as na din. So, pwede na rin natin yun paghandaan ngayon pa lang. Um, easier sumweldo, yung preparation lang, kasi magkakaroon pa yan ng trial or test deposits bago fully maset up yung bank transfer option mo with Google AdSense. Kasi they wanna make sure na makakatanggap ka talaga ng pera doon sa bank account na ipinapasok mo sa kanila for your bank transfer option or for your bank transfer account. So, I hope I was able to answer those questions about Western Union. If you still have any questions regarding YouTube or any questions that you'd like to ask me regarding the technicalities of uh, the YouTube world, please comment it down below. If I cannot give you the exact answer, I'll be finding the person who could help us with the answers that we all need. So with that, thank you so much and I hope to see you again on the next Teen Talks. Don't forget to like, share, and of course subscribe to my channel for more videos about YouTube and vlogs and updates from Teen Talks. Bye guys! Teen Talks!